Introducing the horses for race number six. This evening's sixth race, a condition pace. Racing one mile. First $3,800. A field of seven going postward. Number one, Sun Sum over the Redland Stable. Kevin Austin, Stillings and Kearns of Ohio. Terry Holton trains. Ryan Holton drives. Number two, Crown Time Stoney owned by Esther Cronover. MacArthur Erlowing trains with Dan Ader. Three is Buster Beach, owned by Paul Aschild of Illinois, and Ray Baldwin, Larry Stolbaum, the trainer driver. Four, Shining Sam, owned by Jim Cancer of Columbus, Bob Burnett, the trainer driver. Five, Ramble Lane, owned by Jeff Reed of Granville, Kevin Reed of Newark, Dean Collins, the trainer and the driver. Number six, I'm Ross, owned by Philip Kavanaugh of Upper Sandusky. Brian Brown trains down Irvine Jr. in the bike. And from post seven, Bye Bye Sydney, owned by Gary Mullins of Westerville and Downing of Columbus. Selden Ledford trains Randy Tharps in the Sulky. One play show, perfecta, trifecta wagering, eight minutes until post time. Sixth race, condition pacers all in behind the gate. The gate swings into the back stretch for the start. There they go. And uh, the ball off, and it's Crown Time Stoney, who's first for the lead. A sun sum from off the pylons, came away second, Buster Beach. On the inside is third, I'm Ross, is underway early on the outside. Inside and five, two, Shining a Sam. Next in line is Rambo Lane, the trailer, bye-bye, Sydney. Around the first turn, and I'm Ross, again, wants the front end tonight, and he'll take that lead. Crown Time Stoney on the inside is racing second. Sun Sum at the wheel is third. Opening quarter, 28 and 1. They come to the stretch, and I'm Ross now dictating the pace. But here comes Crown Time Stoney right back to the outside, and these two swapping positions. Crown Time Stoney back in control by two, and I'm Ross will now get the garden spot trip behind the leader. Buster Beach coming first up on the outside as he makes his bid for the lead with Simcoe Lane. Make that Shining Sam right behind him. Shining Sam is also on the move, second over and fourth. Sun Sum is now back in fifth. Then comes Bye Bye Sydney to the outside in sixth. Half and 58 and two as they make the turn to the back stretch. And it's Crown Time Stoney. Odds on favorites here with a lead a half a length. Buster Beach on the outside is showing no progress as they're sitting second. I'm Ross in the pocket is third. With the cover, Shining Sam is waiting fourth. But now moving three wide of the outside, here comes Bye Bye Sydney. Racing into the final turn, and with the lead, it's Crown Time Stoney Buster Beach cashing it in, and he's going back to the pack, up the rail and saving ground. As he round the upper turn is I'm Ross, three quarters, 127 and one. Moving to the top of the stretch, and Crown Time Stoney still with the lead. I'm Ross on the inside, and out of the outside comes Bye Bye Sydney. Now less than a 16th to go, and down the stretch they come. Crown Time Stoney, Bye Bye Sydney, far outside is Shining Sam. Into deep stretch, Crown Time Stoney hanging on tight for place. 155 and four. Upon further review, the judges have determined the uh, seven, or rather the seven horse was not lapped on. He was not lapped on at the wire. The numbers will remain as posted. Two, four, seven. Trackside now the winner, number two, Crown Time Stoney, and eight-year-old son of Brett Mahone for the Miracle Nightmare, Miracle Kelly. Oh, by Esther Cronover, MacArthur, Ohio, Erlowings. The uh, trainer, Dan Eder, in the Sonke. Fourth one of the season for the eight-year-old pacer, the mile and 155 and four.